Hello mommy! If you are looking for the best sleeping position to turn a breech baby, then you are in the right place. In this video we are going to share with you the exact sleeping position, which is the most efficient one to turn a breech baby, because it helps your baby get out of your pelvis and provides your baby with more space to turn. I am Natalie, a pregnancy and birth consultant and TCM therapist. And I am Matthias, a researcher and science geek, and we love helping mummies and their babies in the most natural way possible and science-based. For more useful tips and tools on pregnancy and baby-related topics, make sure that you subscribe to our channel. Also hit the bell so you don't miss any of our videos. We really appreciate having you here. We are so glad that you're here because the sleeping position that we are going to share with you today has not only helped so many pregnant women at my clinic turn their breech baby, it has also helped them with a better night's sleep. Right, so the best sleeping position to turn a breech baby involves the following. First of all, when you go to bed, lay on your left side. And this is really your going to bed position, right? Please don't panic if you wake up during the night and you lay on your right side because According to the newest scientific studies, going to sleep on either the left or the right side appears to be equally safe for your baby. Just don't lie on your back. Yeah. Once you're lying on your left side, you can then use a bunch of pillows to support your body if that makes it more convenient for you to sleep. However, the most important pillow is the one that you put between your legs. Right. Not only can that pillow together with the right sleeping position kind of lift your baby up and out of your pelvis, it also keeps both your hips and pelvis in an open position. And this will provide your baby with more space to turn. So what's important is that you put the pillow between your knees and ankles with as much of your leg on the pillow as possible. Once you've put your pillow between your legs, you can then roll over a bit further so that more of your belly is touching the bed. This ensures that your abdomen is in a forward position so that you nearly lay on your tummy. Mm -hmm. But don't worry, this position is safe for your baby because the pillow between your legs will take your own weight off the baby. However, please make sure that it really feels comfortable. If it feels like you are indeed lying on your belly, then you have obviously rolled over too far. And then once you have rolled over, make sure that your top leg rests forward so that the knee either touches the mattress or at least almost points towards the mattress, depending on the thickness of the pillow that you're using. This will provide your baby with even more space to turn because it prevents that your leg pulls at your hips, which could cause the hip joint to twist. Right. Now, before we continue, can we quickly ask you a question? How are we doing so far? Is it easy to follow our video? We would be super grateful if you could leave us a short comment in the comment section below. Please. Tell us what you like or don't like about our yeah. video or simply subscribe to our channel and or like this video so that we know that you have found it helpful. Any feedback is more than appreciated because it helps us enormously to improve our videos. Thanks so much. Okay, so what kind of pillar do you need in order to support your breech baby to turn? Well, first of all, ideally you do not use a feather pillow because such pillows cannot really keep your pelvis open and the weight off your baby. So ideally you use a bit of a thicker pillow, like for example a foam pillow. You know, the kind of pillow that keeps its shape when you put your leg on it, mm -hmm. or at least something similar. Some women at the clinic have asked me if it is okay to use a U-shaped pregnancy pillow. While these pillows are not ideal for what we're trying to do here, because some of them don't really allow you to keep your abdomen in a forward position so that you nearly lay on your tummy, but you will have to try. Mm -hmm. However, C-shaped pregnancy pillows will definitely work and what you could also use is a breastfeeding pillow. Right. So in a nutshell, here is what's important for the best sleeping position to turn a breech mm -hmm. baby. Go for a pillow that allows you to keep your pelvis open, but which also allows you to bring both your abdomen and top leg into a forward position so that more of your belly lies on the bed without actually lying on your tummy. This sleeping position will considerably increase the chances of your breech baby to turn at night. However, what it does not do is encourage your baby to turn. Right, very good point. So what Natalie means here is that even though the right sleeping position will make it easier for your breech baby to turn, it does not mean that your baby will actually do so. Mm -hmm. Therefore, if you are kind of in a hurry and want your breech baby to turn very fast, then you might want to consider applying a different approach, one that actually encourages your baby to turn. 
That approach involves a combination of breech baby turning exercises as well as a breech baby turning tool. And by the way, that approach has helped many women at the clinic turn the baby instantly. To learn more, simply check out the video that you can now see somewhere at the top of your video screen. Right. Thanks for watching and please remember to leave us a feedback in the comment section below or simply like and share our video if you have found it helpful. We really appreciate each and every one of your reactions because your feedback helps us a lot to improve our videos. Right. And for more useful tips and tools on pregnancy and baby related topics, make sure to subscribe to our channel and to hit the bell.